So, I don't know if any of you guys have experienced whenever you stress or whenever something feels incongruent. For me, it's a little bit of an eye twitch. And over the last three or four years, I've grown quite fond of it to the point where I welcome it whenever it comes about because I know that it's the secret, it's the key for me to understand something about myself. So I wanted to share with you guys, I just had the eye twitch for the last like 24 hours and I didn't, I wasn't sure what it was from because I didn't really feel stress, right? I didn't feel stress as far as my thought patterns and my vantage point, everything is tight, everything is locked in. But I still had the twitch. So I was welcoming it all day, like, hey, what's up, Twitcher? What's up, Twitchy? But now this morning, I'm on my way to a destination uh, where the location is gonna be withheld for now. And I apologize for the rockiness, but the message is more important than the quality of the video. But I realized that, first off, we're in 5D. And I'm, I'm thinking about making a 5D video. If my inner being says go, I'm gonna do it. But we're here. And part of what I'm being showed through my actual physical body is that I can't be anything under forever young anymore. And we talked about this this last, uh, I think it was Tuesday the 24th. But now I want to kind of talk about it briefly in more detail. Because when I mean we can't lie, this is a great example. Somebody shares some news that they're excited about. If you don't truly feel super excited about it, I used to always go, oh my God, that's so great. I'm so happy for you. But that right there wasn't true. Even though I'm happy for them and that's great, that energy, that extra shit, I didn't need to do that. So what I'm beginning to understand is that I can just be, oh, cool, and be genuine about it. But I know a lot of people, because me, I'm a very energetic, high energy guy, but sometimes it's not so much I need to protect my energy, it's, so, it's more so I'm going with exactly how I feel from now on. And if you caught me and you shared something with me, while I feel high energy, I'm gonna be, oh my God, that's dope, man. Congrats, girl. Or if I'm not feeling that way, I'm gonna be like, hey, good job. Or, oh, cool. You know, I'm not gonna do extra sugar on top or adding extra, so to speak, what a lot of people say, you know, oh, sugar coating stuff. I'm done with that because I realize now, not only for your sake, but also for my sake. We're degrading each other when I give you a more than needed, or how do I say this? We're degrading one another when I give you an over, when I say, oh, that's great, and I didn't really feel that way, I'm hurting you and I'm hurting me. I'm hurting you because that wasn't, what you needed to hear because you asked me for a reason so I need to be me and I'm hurting me because that little extra energy I could have just used that in another segment in my day so getting back to the eye twitch we'll have certain we will have certain things that reoccur in our lives our lives our life that are implying or that are showing us, hey, you need to address this. Because I know I've been channeling, I've already channeled, I am here now, full non-physical and physical God force in one. I'm here, I'm, I'm here, I'm here, right? So with that being said, if you're still operating mentally, consciously at a level when physically and non-physically you've already embodied totally who you are, God energy, then you're gonna have certain twitches and certain uneasy or diseases or incongruences. You're gonna have things that don't line up 
that are the key to tell you what you need to do, okay? I'm gonna keep these videos short, you know what I'm saying, because I'm not trying to chew your ear off, but listen to that thing poking you in the side. Listen to your intuition, those twitches, those incongruences where you know that that particular scenario is the key for you to develop internally, emotionally, because it's game time now. We can't keep relapsing back to these old tendencies. We're done with that. We're 5D, we're ascension, and we're here. So next time you feel the contrast, next time you feel the contrast, understand it so you can use it for a new vantage point. Or in other words, understand the contrast so you can grow and you can be to the next level or the next grade or the next chapter, okay? Okay. I hope you guys had a great appreciation giving. I hope you guys have enjoying been been enjoying your time. Most importantly with yourself, but with everything else around you. And until next time, which will be soon. Forever out.